Hello everybody and welcome back Thomas, to Wildflowers. Uh, this isn't the best time. I'm uh, expecting someone. Oh, <laughs> yes, we invited Zephyr to come stay, didn't we? Hi, Thomas. Oh, no, 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 no. No, <laughs> not goblins. Anything but goblins. Oh, wait, uh, I, I'm, I'm Zephyr. And yes, I'm... Uh, uh, goblin, uh, I've been, I've been wanting to chat. I want to clear something up. I think my mom gave your mom a spook in the mine some years ago. Yes, yes, and then the nitrogen levels in our soil started dropping. You did something to leach the nutrients from our land. No, no, it's because the mining company's activities caused flash floods. We goblins would never hurt your farm, Thomas. I got a question for you. I've noticed that things on my farm get repaired all of a sudden. <laughs> that you're doing? Um, yep, 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 yep. Uh, uh, sometimes I tinker around your farm when I see a need for tinkering. This is so cool. So, uh, what do you say? Maybe we could try being, I don't know, uh, normal with each other? Fine. Yay! Uh, I mean, uh, really? I was dead set against witches, but it turns out you magical folks are good for something after all. So, who knows? Yippee! Woo! I'm so excited I could just... <laughs> Whoa, she always do that? Pretty much. That's hilarious. Powered sapphires, nice. Thoroughly, we roll along. Is that that one done then? Yeah. So is, it, is it, that in the fairies fix now? Let's go and have a little look, shall we? I should also probably go and water my flowers in the gloaming. <laughs> when did I last water my flowers in the gloaming? Hmm. A lot has gone on, to be fair. I'll have to go and have a check on that. But yeah, I just want to have a quick check on the fairy first. And just see how that's going. Oh, it's all fixed, look. Surprised there wasn't more kind of said about that. I don't know if I maybe missed something. But never mind. Right, I want to go and have a chat with Parker and then I want to go to uh, have a... I want to do more clothes. I want to make uh, Shelby his stuff. All that good stuff. All right, let's see. Anything new? No. Nailed it. <laughs> Fine. I will go to the gloaming and I will water my flowers then. And then we'll do our usual looking around for stuff. Tara, will you make sure the coven knows they're always welcome at the Consciousness Center? Oh, I can pass the message along. But you spent a long time making us feel unwelcome. Don't be surprised if no one comes. That's very true. Did I ever make sweet potato fries? I did not. Did I ever buy and plant sweet potatoes? I don't think I did either. So that's something we can do today. We can buy some sweet potatoes. We're getting along with Cameron, despite all of that. So I'll... Uh, have a chat to Shelby. Oh, hi. Oh my gosh! I did the car trick just like you said. I can't wait to show my mom and dad. Oh, don't show them how the trick works, you hear? Real magic has got to stay secret. Ooh. You're so gentle with all the kids, Shelby gentler than you treat their parents. They haven't learned to disrespect me yet. Besides, where I come from, we treasure children. Where do you come from, Shelby? We would love to know. Where you come from? You mean the city? He's like, 
Yeah. <laughs> no, no. Somewhere much farther away than that. So it's either a different country or a different realm. I get the sense you've lived a very full life. Lots of adventure. Am I on to something? You haven't the half of it. But one day, you'll understand. You're destined for as much adventuring as me. Sounds standard for Fairhaven. I'm getting the sense that everyone in Fairhaven has lives full of adventure. That's the truth. More or less. No matter what someone wants, fate finds them. And on Fairhaven, fate is always real close by. I have this, like, real feeling right now of just, like, relaxedness with the game. And I, I think it's because we've, like, finished all of the, the stuff. I don't, I feel like I don't really have to worry about much. I'm just gonna kind of ride along and let it all happen sort of thing. I, I don't know. Definitely feeling much more relaxed and chill and cool. Right, let's go and see if all of my flowers have died or if I'm okay right now. Like I say, a lot has gone on and it wouldn't surprise me if that took all my focus away and I didn't realize how many days were passing and all my flowers are dead. Uh, let me see. Wilted, wilted, wilted. Okay, so let's um, broom it on home and see if I've got enough stuff. I need amethyst, right? Do I have much amethyst to do some time turns? I don't. What day are we on? Friday. So Francis should be open. Right, let's go to Francis's shop then. Grab some amethyst. Go and see if I can make a few time turn spells. And we'll just uh, revive our flowers. Like I say, everything went a bit crazy. The gloaming got locked for a while. <laughs> and all crazy stuff happened in, in the day. And I just forgot about those flowers. And like I say, it did. It doesn't even surprise me that I, I went back there and they were wilted away. Really doesn't surprise me at all. So let's just get everything back to where we should. Yeah. Suddenly everyone's cutscenes are coming in. <laughs> oh, those are pretty. Thanks. They're matching wedding bands for me and Angus. I've been working on them for ages. And then this morning he said he doesn't want to wear a wedding band. Something about being worried about losing it in the dough or burning himself on the oven. Well, stick it on a chain around your neck. I've got a friend who's a vet nurse and she's going to be getting married, so that's where she puts her engagement ring when she's working with the animals. I'm trying not to be devastated, but totally not succeeding. Maybe he could wear it a different way. Maybe he could wear it a different way where he wouldn't lose it. Like on a necklace? That's such a cheesy idea. But Angus is kind of cheesy, so he might go for it. Thanks, Tara. <laughs> I've just said my friend is doing that, and it's like, oh, that's so cheesy. Really? Thanks, Francis. You know. Keeping it real? my mouth for me. I think I'm just anxious because I'm trying to, like, cobble together a new family out of the two of us. And maybe some kids of our own, if I could ever get Angus on board. I fell out with my family. So he's all the family I have. Yeah, I remember Angus saying to me earlier in the in the series that he doesn't want kids, but Francis does. Why did you guys have a falling out? Oh, did they not like Angus? Oh, no, not at all. They love him. In fact, Angus has been trying to talk me into reconciling with them. But I don't know if I can forgive my brother for what he did. That's what I love about Angus, you know? He's always trying to see the good side of people. Most of the time, anyway. Yay! I forget what Francis's brother did to him, though. Ah oh, well, <laughs> I can go look that up later. That's fine. Um. So, what are we looking like now for people's likes and dislikes and all that sort of thing? Quite, quite good now, aren't we? We're getting there with a lot of people. Juliet, Lena. Shelby still needs a bit of work. Perry and Sebastian still need a bit of work. Oh, that really is all it is. And then obviously Gloria. 
I should go and make some crystal ball potions for Gloria. I'll find out the stuff she likes and then we can try and make friends with her this year. Um, but, oh, duh, the amethysts. Nothing like a cutscene to make me forget what I was actually going in there for. Right, show. I want three amethysts, please. Thanks. <laughs> and we'll head back to my to my bat cave and we'll go make some time turn potions and then I'll I'll try and remember my flowers a bit more after that. I I might not always have things growing in the gloaming, but uh, I'll try to be better about watering them when I do. Like I say, it's probably going to be a little less frenetic now. <laughs> right then, so let's have a look. I'll just broom it over. And we'll go and fix those flowers up. <laughs> just kind of like finishing up the things that I didn't properly finish up last time. I, I was kind of really excited about the whole new all of the stuff that was going on and then after that there was like we had a couple of days of sort of things like seeing grandma again and like there was all sorts of really interesting things happening and that is always when I'm going to forget things like that so let's just pretend like it never happened thank you Shelby for this spell is a couple of times I've had to use it now and it's extremely useful Especially for the gloaming flowers, because they're easy to forget, because they're out of sight and out of mind. Although those ones, I think, had grown quite a bit before they wilted, sadly, but, you know. Not the end of the world. People have said if I want to get bottles from fishing that it's better to use chub for it. So that is what I will do. And I will continue to fish in the mines, in the lakes, in the rivers, la la la. Um, I had someone saying that they, they're just not getting any bottles or anything from the mountains. In fact, I'm going to go over to the mountains right away. Or anything from the mountains anymore. And they still had about 15 recipes to go or something. So there might be things that are coming up in the second year story... There might be things that are just really low chance to get. I don't know. Is it a... <gasps> it is! A recipe! I think that's another one that might be a... A mirror favourite. Yep. We've got like almost all of the things that are her favourites now. And I think we've got a lot of the things that were Kai's favourites as well. <laughs> but still, no Ariel favourites. I'm like, is there some secret way to get... Um, no one's mentioned it, if, it, if there is. A lot of people mentioning doing lots of fishing and hmm. lots of digging. I found something. <gasps> A recipe! Precipsy. No, precipizy? Something like that. That's not a thing that Ariel likes, is it? No, still not. Malasada. Apparently someone was saying that they'd found Malasada like really early on and they were like doing great with Ariel and it's like so luck based. <laughs> so, so luck based. I think they said they found it fishing or something. So yeah, now I've done that. I've got the flowers back to where they should be. Is it a Bruno open day today? Because I want to... I want to be trying to find where Bruno is because we might now be starting to get something going on with him. I'm not sure though. Uh, Friday's closed. Yeah, okay, let's go see where Bruno's at at the moment. Uh, going into the mines is not going to help with that at all. And we can do a bit, a bit of fishing down by the sea, see if we can catch any bottles down there. And I, like I say, I'll try and fish with chub now. I'll just give all the other bait to, to fishy to deal with. And I'll just keep like 20, 30 chub on me at all times. There's no reason I shouldn't be using it. 
Um, let's start start across here. And then just head along the beach and see if Bruno's around anywhere. Oh yeah, there he is. No cutscenes though. You could have told me I was onto something with the fairies. It was a secret. <laughs> Not so much as you'd think. I always knew someone was fixing my broken fishing oh. poles. <laughs> was Zephyr fixing the fishing poles? Oh, Zephyr is so cute. I love her so much. I I can't be bothered getting the blueberries today. So we want to do a bit of fishing, don't we? But with chub. I don't have any chub. Darn. Oh well, we'll do it with crickets. I've I've gotten bottles with crickets before. So that's not going to be a bottle today. Got one. Doesn't matter what I fish up, um, but if I've stuck the bait in anyway, I may as well get something out of it. I'm going to fish in the sea, and I'm going to fish in the mines. Uh, I have had it confirmed from someone in the comments that uh, you will not get. So I'll, I'll grab some more chub off Fishy or something, or from Bruno tomorrow. Oh, quick! That the cat, uh, when you're in cat form, you're not going to get anything. Anything in the way of bottles. You have to have bait. So, I will believe you on that one. It doesn't surprise me. I've personally never had a bottle when I've, when I've been in cat form. So, it doesn't surprise me at all. I found a couple of bottles fishing in the mines. Um, I haven't found any fishing up at the mountain. Oh, oh yeah. I found a couple early game at the lake in the woods. But I haven't found so many recently. I have actually had quite a few recipes from fishing. You would be surprised. I had a, a little tip on the bottles as well. So a little tip to help me. Oh, you know what I didn't do? The sweet potatoes. I meant to do those for Cameron. Oh well. We'll do those tomorrow. Right, Fishy, I want to just change over the bait a little bit, please. So I want to have some of the chub if you've got any left. No, you don't. You only have crickets and worms. Okay. That is fine. I will go and buy that from Bruno tomorrow and we'll try and buy some sweet potatoes from Lena at the same time. I will... I'll have a go fishing in the mines. You never know. I might be able to, to get something with crickets. Yeah, I think there's a lot of recipes still to be had in the mines because I haven't fished here much. As soon as the bottle sinks, it's on the hook. Oh no. Oh come on. Ugh. Try again. I'll keep fishing in here. I think there's definitely a a, char a bigger chance for bottles to pop in here. I get overexcited, okay. <laughs> I'm worried that I'll miss things. <laughs> gotcha. The mice is quite good because you can keep going round them as well. Go around all the different spots and do them several times each. Oh, there's a spot like up here as well. Oh yeah, there is. Oh, quick! 
Feeling super chill though, isn't it? Just like, yeah, we'll go fishing and we'll get some recipes and we'll do this and we'll do that. <laughs> we'll try again tomorrow. Ooh. I have had two two in the mines a day on the fishing, two recipes a day show up and I caught one and missed one. So it's not beyond doubt that, uh, uh, that I might get another one pop up. There we are. Quick! Don't be so impatient this time though, Sheila. Oh, oh yeah. I had to wait for it to sploosh. <laughs> Hang on, this this isn't a fish. It's some kind of recipe. Rice wine. For my distillery. Nice, okay, well, it's time to go to bed. It's midnight, but we got three new recipes today. And we time turned and watered all of the gloaming flowers, so they should start to, to grow a bit more now. I might make a fertilizer or boost potion for them as well, if I if I remember and if I get the time. Let's have a chat to Wesley. Gloria is such a warm presence. It's good to see her walk the streets of Ravenwood Hollow again. I think I need to get some more oh, stuff for Wesley, am don't I? Ready I? For bed? I did grow him some green beans so I could get him some like roast beef oh. and stuff like that. So I think we'll need to, to do that because I you can keep getting hearts for dating opportunities apparently. It's like, you want a date with Wesley? You gotta work on your marriage. <laughs> okay. Morning, Violet. Oh, it's all the Mirandas. I wanted to see the wild farm again. Violet said you restored it to its former glory. I just wanted to go for a walk. He's still getting used to mom being here. So he's like her barnacle. I heard that. <laughs> Otto's called an emergency meeting. Will you two come with us? Sure. It would be our pleasure. Good morning. I am truly glad to see you all looking well. Otto soft, everybody. Now, with 100% less slime. There's no point in theatrics. I am resigning as the mayor of Fairhaven, effective immediately. He had to do this. No shocker there. He kind of had to step down. Yep. Right? Meeting Stranger Danger Vanessa in the woods for all those years was corruption. I think. Stranger Danger Vanessa. I l Violet's the best. I love her so much. Who will replace you? Gloria. I would like to nominate Gloria Miranda to be interim mayor until you all can hold another election. That was utterly a no-brainer. Does anyone disagree with that? No. Good. Gloria, do you accept? I... Uh, I do. Then that's settled. And it means that Vanessa and I can leave Fairhaven. Mm, now the ferry's fixed. The state attorney general wants to have a conversation about some of my, um, past fundraising efforts. Oof. I have something to say. I'm sorry for the way I acted. I may have been possessed by a wraith, but before that, I kept secrets and manipulated people. I was only concerned about myself. I'm sorry to the Coven, and to Juliet especially. I've thought about it, and I don't have a place in Fairhaven. Not right now. Or ever. So I've spoken to Giva about taking over at the school. Ah, oh, perfect person to teach. I'm quite excited. We'll be taking the next ferry to Milkwater. Bye, Vanessa. And then, a sea monster came out of nowhere and ate the fairy. Violet. Uh, Violet? 
Am I secretly Gloria? Joking. Joking. <laughs> hey, I, I just realized I came to Fairhaven a year ago today. And do you wish that you were on that ferry? Heading back to the city? No. Not for anything. It's at the end! We should do, uh, keep a look at the credits, it just depends on how long they're gonna be. I've had some credits that go on for like 10 minutes. Oh, all the voice actors! Go voice actors! Musicians. Sometimes I worry about like, oh, is this the stuff I'm putting out good quality and la 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 la. And then I see quality stuff coming out like quality games, quality um, really high quality stuff quality films all that sort of thing and you see how many people are involved for how long making something like that and it's like yeah i'm doing all right for me on my own with no one helping me <laughs> it's really easy to compare like what you do to <laughs> something like this look at all those people Post-production. All the audio engineers that they've had on that, and you've still got things like Wesley sounding echoey. Do you know what I mean as well? So even things with all of these people on them can be like not 100% perfect. Localization. But to be fair, this, like as much as I say that there's the odd thing, this is a really quality game. I've never played a game with... Maybe up there with Sandrock in the... Although this is shorter than Sandrock, in the sh pure amount of narrative that's in it. Um, and I absolutely love games like that. They're, they're clearly made with a passion. Somebody had a really clear idea of where they wanted this to go and they really had a passion for it. They had a passion for accessibility and good storytelling, I would say. Go for all the special thanks. I mean, considering I've done 37 episodes on this, I feel like everybody that's been involved in this deserves like a, a tiny spot in, in the Limelight. Okay, legal notices now, so I think we're near the end. Produced by Apple. Interesting. Alright then, Tara. Let's have a look at your mailbox. Congratulations on finishing the first year of Wildflowers. We hope you've enjoyed playing. Although you've finished the main story, there are plenty more stories to experience, so check in with people over the coming days if you want to see more. We hope you enjoyed the game, Studio Drydock, which we will be carrying on with. And like I say, I was starting to feel that feeling of chill, and now I'm really feeling the feeling of chill. I know we need to keep on going with trying to find... I want to unlock uh, all of Violet's recipes. I want to get uh, all of the, <laughs> as many of the cooking recipes as I can. Possibly not all of them, I'm not too worried about being a completionist in this, but I do really want to be friends with everybody. And I feel like I don't have the opportunity to do that with Ariel at the moment. So I would like that opportunity. 
So if I can find anything... Oh, I'm not finding a third dirt patch at the moment. People are saying that sometimes there's a fourth dirt patch up at the summit or something? Or that I should go up to the summit? Oh, right, so there's sometimes one up there. I see. Which I may have been missing all this time. Okay. I mean, that's technically the summit, right? Not a lot going on there today, but I guess we could keep having a look. But they might have meant that third patch of dirt that was up there, and sometimes apparently that can be a fourth patch. So, that is fine. I want to go and see Bruno and Lena today at their shop, so I want to get some sweet potato seeds from Lena. I want to get lots of sweet potatoes, because apparently I don't have any for the sweet potato fries. I tried to make some, and I couldn't. Oh, hey Bruno. Well, you came to me, did you? I have a hankering for some company the next time I go fishing by the bridge. Okay. Want to be that company? Sure. <laughs> it is an honor I can't refuse. I maybe should put my overalls and wellies on for that one. <laughs> You're sweet. I'll set up by the bridge tomorrow morning. Go fishing with Bruno tomorrow. Cool. So, maybe I should be back in my overalls anyway, because, like, we're back to work. We're back to work as Tara now. Tara the farmer. The green dress is more Tara the witch. Uh, in fact, is there anything I can sell to Violet at the moment? Do I have any spare dresses that I'm not really using? Oh, Parker, what's going on there? I was hoping to give Lena some tulips for our anniversary, but Violet's all sold out. Oh. I've been checking every day to see if she gets some in stock, but now I think Violet's avoiding me. Are you growing any flowers on your farm? Uh, yeah, I'm growing some. Yes, I planted a few flowers. That's great. Lena's never really understood why I love flowers so much, but she does like tulips. I really like them too. I think it's because they're Dutch. Hmm. Oh, is Lena Dutch? Um, no, Norwegian, but that's <laughs> kind of close, right? Not even remotely. <laughs> Geography was never really my strongest subject. Anyway, if you have any tulips to spare, you would really save the day. Maybe she just likes them because they're pretty. Or maybe they have good value for the wellspring. <laughs> okay, I'll let you know if I've got some. Awesome, thanks. Oh, apparently I already have some. Any luck with the tulips? Yes. Um, here they are. Thanks so much. I know it might seem old-fashioned, but I'm a fan of the surprise romantic gesture. I'm sure she'll love them, Parker. You think so? She's a hard nut to crack sometimes. But that's part of why I love her. Nice. My best friend, anyway. Um... Let's go and see if we can sell anything to you, missus. Oh no, I've only got like... Well, I could remake the signature one or I could sell the gloaming one and remake that. The mint on demand shorts. Worth it for the new designs. Better than a tux jacket. Blue mosaic leggings and blue bell breeze frilly. Let's go shopping. And we'll slowly make some new bits and pieces and I will create my favourites to make basically a nice wardrobe for Tara. It'll be wonderful. Okay. And sure. Uh... I am hoping to get various different types of, uh... Alright, let's go see Lena for the sweet potato seeds. I've got a feeling I probably have sweet potatoes, don't do I not have them? No, 
No, I just don't. I must have just used them for something. Okay. Luckily, since the greenhouse has been built, I can do anything I want now, which is fantastic. I'm so happy. Lena. After your work, I'm going to follow Last you. Last spring, Hazel was still with us, and I was still telling her that we couldn't afford to be honest with our neighbors. Hazel, if you're listening, I was wrong. I'll happily admit it. Right then, let's get me some sweet potato seeds. Let's buy like eight of them. Anything else I want to do at the moment? I can make some wheat seeds to get flour, but I can just buy flour and I've got loads of money, so I don't really need to worry about that. Oh yeah, strawberries and tomatoes, because... They're favourites of my cows and chickens. That would be a good one. So I think they're all out of stock at the moment. So I'm going to go and plant those. Give uh, Planty something to do. Oh, when I want to say out of stock. I mean out of season. They're all out of season at the moment. Pretty sure. So I think they all need to go in the greenhouse. I don't think there's anything that's in season that I particularly want to plant right now. And I probably have time to give them a wee water as well. I'll have a look and see if there's any honeydew. I'll have a look and see if I can make Shelby's stuff. Because we just had a cutscene with Shelby, which means that I can work on sort of upping his friendship with me again a little bit. Strawberries in that one. Tomatoes at the back. And then we'll just do a couple of other sweet potatoes around the sides. Once they're grown, that means I can make some sweet potato fries for Cameron. But yeah, so I'm guessing that um, previously it would have been the very end of everything at the credit rolling but then they've added a patch I think to add like a little bit of extra content and to get sort of finish off Bruno's story all that sort of stuff so once I've done this I'll need to go to the gloaming today and water my flowers as well And I think at the moment I don't have any, do I have any flowers growing? I don't have any flowers growing right now, which means that I'm not making any like honey. So if I need any candles or anything like that, I can't really do them at the moment. So it might be nice just to pop over to Violet's if she's open and grab whatever seeds are, flower seeds are in season and just grow those. I think I might just grow whatever I need in my greenhouse crop wise. So I'm thinking it might be cool to go down to Kai's and just like grow more trees or something in the the remaining pots I've got in the garden. Or have all flowers and then have all trees at the top or something like that. So I might move things about a little bit now. So snowdrops and tulips at the moment. Okay, so let's do four snowdrops. And uh, a eight tulips, I think. But like I say, I might be changing things up because I think I'm going to be changing some stuff around so that I have more flowers, so I grow seasonal flowers and then whatever crops I need at the time in the greenhouse. I think that's where we're going to go with this. So let's head up here and move some stuff around. And then I can always go back up to Violets and get some more seeds once I know exactly how many I'm going to need.
So what I might need to do is do... Oh, I need 10, don't I? So it'd be maybe 10 of each by the time I've moved everything around. Because I'm just not needing... I've got all of this like space and things and I'm just not needing it all, you know? Uh, I need to bring some trees up. I can just work out then, like, do I want a couple more trees? What do I want? What's my final farm going to look like? sure why I've got one extra. Oh yeah, because of that. I think that one, honestly, I want to get rid of. So... I want to have my... Yeah, my beehives are quite happy in the corner there, doing their thing. I want to have like 20 of each. Um, Violets is just shut, so I'll plant what I've got and then we'll go and fill in the rest tomorrow. So from now on, it's going to be like 10 of everything. And I'll plant them all and water them all today and everything. And then Planty can carry on for me after that. We've done a lot. Oh, I wanted to get bait from Bruno today as well and I didn't do it. I think he's shut tomorrow, but that's fine. We'll do his cutscene tomorrow, and I'll I'll get back on it as soon as I as soon as I can. So well, let's have snowdrops in the other bed, and then I can have three more trees. So you may have noticed, um, kind of. I don't, it wasn't actually even on purpose, but a bit of a change in schedule to have this at 10 o'clock. So now I've finished the main story. The idea with the schedule for this is going to be that it will be done in the weekdays. So usually um, Sunday to Thursday, we'll have wildflowers in the evening until I'm done with all the content I want to do and then we'll change to something else. Uh, and then in the... Just do this. And then on the weekends we'll have like whatever demos I can find. If I if for whatever reason I don't have a demo to do, we'll just do more wildflowers. So that's kind of the idea with that. Um so yeah, we've like nicely planted everything. Did I go to, did I dig up all the soil this morning? I do not remember. Let me just check. I'll be able to see if they're the soil's gone. Oh, it looks like I did. I think I did it first thing this morning. Um, I haven't done my gloaming flowers, so let's go and do those. And maybe we can chat with the coven. See what they're up to. At I'm the moment. furious with Vanessa. How dare she do this after being welcomed into this town? It's gonna be so fun having Francis in the coven. We need more witches our age. Gloria's here now. Gloria is such a delight. I already see us being best friends. What a woman. I know comparing isn't the greatest thing to do, but Vanessa's taste in jewelry is so tacky. Gloria's been a breath of fresh air. She gives me a vibe and lets me go wild. Nice. Aha. Uh -huh. You need cupcakes? Do you need to go... Sh do you need to shrink? Wow. There really are a lot of us now. 
And there will be more of us before we know it. Sebastian and Juliet will soon be of age to join us, if that's the path they choose. Mom, before you returned, all my brother could talk about was how he couldn't wait to leave the island as soon as he was old enough. Yeah, but maybe if he knows he can do magic, he might change his mind. And I can't imagine Juliet has a very positive impression of witches right now. Perhaps you could have a little celebration to welcome them and introduce them to the circle as future members of the coven. Oh, I'm a on party? It. I'm on it. What do we need? I'm not going to say where was my party. How selfish. I'll make the punch. It's a party for kids, Damon. Pretty sure anyone but you should be in charge of the punch. <laughs> Tara, could you bake some cupcakes? Violet can be in charge of the flowers. And Damon, you can make the punch, but it better just be made of juice. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> better just be made of juice. Okay, so we're going to need a lot of chocolate for this. Uh, I better go and see Kai tomorrow for that one. Oh, flowers. Do not forget. I'm being much better at <laughs> nearly forgetting but not forgetting to do the things I actually came to do. Those flowers will will grow, I promise. <laughs> this will probably be my last batch until until I run out a bit more. Um I'm gonna make four for that one. I could boost it. But we're gonna have another eight of them. And it, they go a long way to be fair. One day remaining on that one. And two days remaining on that one. So yeah, a couple more days of watering these. I'll have a nice little stock of flowers. And then if I need some more, I'll probably try my best to brew some potions to... Well, actually, we could do that now, couldn't we? We could try. For the... Maybe not for the ones that are going to be ready tomorrow morning, but for the, the other ones that are going to take a couple of days, we could still get a big booster potion on them and get like 10. Then I won't have to do as much. So let's see what I need for a big booster potion if I can if I can make that. Cause the more boosted they are, the more flowers I get and the less I have to worry. So speed up growth. No, I want the boost harvest bumper. Oh, we need essence of silver. Okay. I will put on a couple of essence of silvers. And we can just bump up all of the yields. Okay. Uh, not quite bedtime yet, so let's go and check on the clothing side of things. We got some more silk. Wonderful. I think the mulberry tree might actually be ready to to rock but i might make uh, i've got room for more trees so another mulberry tree might actually be worthwhile doing so when i go to see kai tomorrow after we go to see bruno we're gonna get all the chocolate he has because <laughs> i think five cupcakes might be more chocolate than i've got It is- it isn't, okay. I'm actually low on sugar. Which I can just get from Lena. Or I could maybe... Possibly... Make some sugar here. Can I not make sugar? No, I can't. Okay. I don't know what these are. There's definitely things still to unlock in this game. 100%. There's still things missing. Alright, bedtime now. Bed? And so tomorrow we will go fishing with Bruno. It's been annoying we haven't been able to get his second heart until now. I'll make sure that Planty is doing Planty's job first as well. There's quite a lot to, to do today, isn't there, Planty? Uh, yeah, and you have run out. So let's give you a diamond. Hey, Planty! Water some plants for me today. And it looks like... Miney is back as well, so... I will take everything from you, because you've got a lot of stuff. Woohoo! 
And hey, see you in two Mike. weeks. It's off to work you go. <laughs> see you in two weeks, Miney. Enjoy. Okay. Loggy, I really don't need doing any more logging at the moment. Uh, that might come in, in the future, but I think they're all pretty good at the moment. Uh, I need to check Feedy's stock as well. Because there's no good having a Feedy that doesn't have any, uh, any feed. 31, that'll do us for five more days. Is today a Marty open day? Sunday, yes. So we'll go and see Marty as well as... We need some sugar from Lena for the cupcakes. Then I need to make a charm potion and some stargazing potions. Uh, incantation, sorry. Which I will need some flowers for. What's that? The bridge. Hey Bruno, let's go fishing. You made it! <laughs> Go ahead, cast your line next to me. <sighs> Did you want to talk? Nope. I just wanted to tell you that I'm sorry Otto and Vanessa chose what they chose. Yeah. It's not your fault. It's not, but it... He didn't help things. He could have steered things if he wasn't too busy drinking, maybe. Or seen things, maybe helped. I'll wait for my boy here. So the island still feels like home when he comes back. Hmm. What about you? <sighs> but what about you? Do you want to stay in Fairhaven? Course I do. Fairhaven's the only home I ever had. That's true no matter what daffy decisions my boy makes. And I'm no fool. I know he's made plenty. You're a really good dad. Oh, come on now. Don't make me get all weepy. I mean it. Yeah, but... Oh, come here, you son of a gun! <laughs> Good job. Fried flounder sandwiches. <laughs> Lovely. Okay, so now it's probably time for me to get over to Lena's and get some sugar for the party. Uh, Marty's just coming out, so I'll just go and get a couple hundred feet of him. I want to fix the lighthouse. He's sitting there going, fix me, the whole time. And I've been like, I can't. I don't know how. Oh, Amira, I've got cookies for you. Let me just talk to you and make it's sure so you're not strange on having a Gloria back. I expect it might put Lena on edge for a while. Really? Why? Because she's a more experienced coven member than Lena, and older, and lots of stuff. Because if it had been Gloria who was head of the coven when Lena disappeared, Gloria might have gone in after her. Hmm. And Lena knows it. Gossip. Huge gossip. Right, let's just see where you're at. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We absolutely need to give you gifts all the way. So have an oatmeal cookie. It's funny, when I was in med school, my mother used to come fill up my entire cupboard with oatmeal raisin cookies. She knew I would turn to sugary snacks when pulling all-nighters, so she wanted to try to at least make them healthy. That was a big boost. Wow. Okay. Um, what else are we needing to do right now in terms of, like, getting to know people? Well, making those... The Perry and Shelby is going to help because I need to do things with both of them. Ariel, I'm just going to try and keep going. Cameron, we're growing some sweet potatoes for. Bruno, we probably now need to 
give him some presents, I would imagine. Damon, Emmy, and Finn were fine. Oh, yeah, and I need to do some crystal ball potions on Gloria. Okay. All right, back to the back cave again, then. And let's do the crystal ball potions for Gloria. And then I want to work on what clothes I want, so... Oh, yeah, some booster potions for the gloaming flowers. So let me just see if I can get those done. How long are they going to take? Eight hours. So if I go and water my stuff at about four o'clock, that should be fine. Okay, wonderful. Um, I'll do a little bit of essence of copper in all of these for now. And maybe some essence of joy as well. Then I can insta-brew anything I need. Uh, right. I actually think before I go to the mountain, I want to go into town and get the sugar from Lena. Oh, Lena won't be around today, will she? Mm, in that case, I'm going to go and see if I can uh, find her. Because she hangs out in the woods sometimes. I'm going to see if she's hanging around in the woods right now. Oh, Lena, are you here? Mira's here. Yeah. Here, but not not cutscene worthy. Giva apparently. remembered how much the twins loved their lemonade stand. She's going to do a unit on basic economics using the lemonade stand as an example. Aww. Emmy is over the moon. Oh, that's so cute. That's adorable. I don't know what the deal is with her then. I'll go and give Shelby a fish stew. I think I did make a few of these for him. I, uh... I used your watch. Don't make me sad again, Tara. I'm glad. Not everyone gets the chance to say the things that needed to be said. Thank you, Shelby. <laughs> Thank you so much. Aww. Wasn't nothing. <laughs> and for that, you may have some fish stew. Is that heavenly aroma fish stew? Why, thank you. You're welcome. I never give you presents. So we're just looking now for like a uh, sort of best friend level or intimate friend level or whatever they call it when it's only four hearts I think it's best friend but I am gonna head back and I will eventually find Lena. it might be that it has to be on a weekday or something I'll find Lena's secret eventually oh I wanted to go to Kai and get some more mulberry trees didn't I yeah I'll eventually get through my list of things that I wanna wanna do. I've got a lot of them in my head at the moment and as they as they dwindle, I will probably add new things to them, but Right then, Kai. Uh I will get any chocolate or spices you have. Chilies. Chocolate. Alright. Mulberry seedling. Perfect. Um don't have silkworms at the moment, but I will take the saffron, the pineapple, the paprika. Some more oranges, maybe? Like, what other thing could I plant? Apples, mulberries, I've got olives. I'll, put, I'll do one orange. And we'll go and plant those. And then Planty can look after them for me. Was that all I wanted from... Yeah, I think it was. That was all I wanted from Kai. Oh, Natalia. What's going on with you? Hey, Atera. Got a minute? Yeah. Now that Fairhaven is safe, I've got plenty of minutes. What's going on? 
I've been thinking, and I still feel real bad about accusing Sophia of being a witch. Mm. Not that being a witch is anything terrible. I know, Natalia. It's fine. Of course, the Wraith was part of it, but the Wraith picked me. What can I do to make Sophia forgive me? You can't make her forgive you, but you could create something heartfelt. That's a great first step. Oh, last summer, I did hear her say that she missed her best cast iron pan. It cracked. I could make her a new one? Or better yet, a whole set. Uh, that's the spirit. Oh, I'm low on supplies. The next time you're in the mine, do you think you could pick me up a few things? No, but miney can. <laughs> sure thing. Oh, thanks a million, Tara. You always give the best you advice. You think I go in the mines? <laughs> I can't wait to get started on that cast iron pan. Your wait is officially over. Oh, this is gorgeous stuff. Thanks, Tara. It won't take long to shape this into a set of pans. But then, oh, I gotta give it to Sophia. Hey, it's okay. Just be sincere. Sophia really appreciates sincerity. Yeah. Did Vanessa ever go and say, I'm really, so well, I suppose she did say, I'm really sorry. But it's going to take a lot, like, Sophia's got a lot to get over. You're right. Wish me luck. Whereas Vanessa and Otto just left. They could have stayed here and tried to make reparations and they didn't. They just took the easy way out in a way. Maybe they'll come back at some point and try to... Maybe they feel that people need space at the moment, but I don't know. All right then. Natalia has done her pans. I've, I've given... Parker, flowers for Lena. We've had, we've done all sorts of stuff today. We went fishing with Bruno. Okay, so we're gonna plant two more. An orange and a mulberry. And then I have one space left. Uh, I think what I will do is wait for another mulberry tree. Because I've got a lot of... I've got two lemon trees. I've got a lime, a pomegranate, a mulberry, an apple, an olive. Two orange. So if I had two lemon, two lime, two mulberry, two orange or something like that, that, that would be quite nice. And then ones that are individual down the front there. We could do a little bit of rearranging like that, I think. That might be quite nice. And then I've got like a spot there where I took the bed away, which is kind of good for rearranging because I can put something there while I rearrange things. Oh, and yeah, Violet. We need to go and get uh, two tulips and six. Oh, I just turned five. <laughs> she shut on a Monday, I think she is. It's fine, we'll get it sorted. Like, we've got enough for now. It'll help stuff grow, but. Close on a minute. Yeah, we'll go get some more flowers on Tuesday then, and they'll they'll eventually grow over the spring. So I want to get down into my basement and I want to make myself a charm potion. Ah, an hour and a half left, okay. Fine. Oh yeah, and the incant I could probably do the incantations now. Let's have a look. So it was uh, a summon knight. Oh, hang on. Let me make sure. Yeah, summon knight. Alright, so we can give those to Shelby now. Uh, except we can't because Shelby will be at Coven pretty soon and I won't be able to hand things in there. But that's fine. Charm Potion as soon as I can and Cupcakes as soon as uh, I can get to Lena's tomorrow. That'll be fine. Let's head up the mountain and see if I can find any recipes and then we'll head down the mines. Oh, I forgot to get the chub as well today. I will slowly get through this list of things I, I keep forgetting. Know, oh! Lena. To be real with you... If it weren't for the kids, I wouldn't even be talking to you right now. Ooh. 
I want to start over. <clears throat> Hi there, handsome stranger. I'm Lena. I'm a witch. Lena? Handsome stranger? Come on. Hi, Lena. I'm Parker. I'm not a witch. But, but if you had just told me the truth from the beginning... <laughs> I know. Do you think we could take these seedlings and plant them together anyway? When I first met you, I, I felt like you understood me, like we were meant to put roots down together. But I didn't know you at all. Wow, what a coincidence. So why don't we get to know each other while we get these seedlings in the ground? Hey, you gotta water them right away so they don't get transplant shot. <laughs> Learn that one the hard way. Here, like this. And this is my cue to leave. Well, they're trying. That was adorable. I'm glad I came to the mountain in the evening. <gasps> so that's why people were telling me about the summit, I, I imagine. Maybe there's more things up there. But <laughs> no, I bet that's what it was. Um, anything to dig up today? Any, any digs? There we are. Dig, dig, dig. Yeah, I'm getting loads of cutscenes at the moment because there's a lot of things that have clearly been like sitting gated behind story, behind the story ending. I imagine now the story, the main story has ended, that there'll be no story gating at all now, and everything that can be gotten should be able to be gotten. Uh, all money today, that sucks. I'll go down the mine and see if I can catch any recipes with crickets. And then I'll uh, see if I can put that charm potion on before I go to bed as well. Might not have time, we'll see. Depends on how into the fishing I get. All I want right now is just one thing that I can give to Ariel as a present. Everyone else, I'm giving presents and their their hearts are going whoop. <laughs> and Ariel's like, I hate strawberry milkshakes. Why do you keep giving me these? I don't even like them. I I want I want a peanut thing. Uh. That's okay. <laughs> Apparently we're, we're mining now. That is one thing I enjoy about this game is not having to change tools all the time. You go back to games where you've got to change tools on a hotbar and it's like, I don't know what I'm doing. Ooh, quick. <laughs> gotcha. I'll catch whatever I can catch, but like, I am not looking for fish at the moment, so. Although down here, actually, oh, 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 there's one. Oh, yeah. Got you, recipe. Oh, I found something. A recipe. Chicken fricassee. Can I refish the spot? No. It looked like there might have been a fish there that I've never had before, but uh, you know what, it's fine. This is kind of the equivalent. It used to be that I'd come down in the mines and try and work my way through the mines oh, yeah. as my like evening relaxation time. And that's kind of been replaced now with recipe hunting. I haven't been to water my flowers today though. They can survive one day, but I'll need to go and take my boost potions over there tomorrow as soon as I can. But yay, we got a recipe. Every time I get a recipe, 
it's knocking off a recipe that I could have gotten that would have been a favorite. Do you know what I mean? Charm post room for better. Pick up these guys. I want to quickly see if I've got any crystal ball potions for Gloria. I do. G for Gloria. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something. Lemon square. Don't know how to make it. It's um. Right, so I'll need to make make or buy more crystal ball potions. I'm gonna go see Perry tomorrow, so that'll be a thing. I'll have a quick it's chat with Wesley. It's always a treat when Gloria stops by. The woman knows her literature. Should I go to bed? Yes. <sighs> and tomorrow we'll get the sugar for the cupcakes and we'll have a party. And that'll be the end of this episode, I think, then. Just one more day. And it is a rainy day today. Do I have anything to do? Oh, hello, Thomas. Hi, Thomas. Get your spring crops in yet? Well, yes, but you see, I filled up all my plots before I realized I um wanted to plant some flowers. I didn't know you liked flowers. I thought that was more Parker's thing. Unless they're for someone <gasps> else. They better be. You're really going to make me come out and say it, aren't you? Yes. Yep, sure am. Fine. I want to give them to <laughs> Sophia. Happy? Yeah. Barry. <laughs> I was going to invite her over to dinner, but thought I ought to give her some flowers first. Folks still That's do that, so don't cute. they? Well, here. I got some seeds from Violet. If you've got room in your garden or your greenhouse, I sure would appreciate it. I just so happen to need to plant some more snowdrops. I only have two at the moment, but I've already got some on the grow, so we'll plant the ones he's given. Because these are snowdrops, aren't they? Yeah. I do want to get some more from um, Violet as well. Can't do that till Tuesday, so I'm going to now need to get another four. But in fact, I'll probably need to adjust my chair. Um, I'll probably need to get another six because obviously I'm gonna have to harvest two of them and then I'll need two tulips as well Greenhouse is all doing great A Couple of spots that I don't have anything in yet and uh, I'll get one more mulberry tree when I'm able to I need to give feedy the feed There we are so you'll be good for a couple of weeks now perfect Planty's done all of the planting and everything. Was there anything else I wanted to do? Uh, go and grab sugar. Then go see Shelby and Perry. Okay. Sugar for the cakes. I wonder if that was Lena's cutscene now, if it was just a general one. No, it wasn't. So I still need to find where, where her cutscene will be. Parker and I have been going on dates again. Actual dates. Aww. Not just collapsing on the couch and watching TV in silence after the kids are asleep. That's nice. I'm really, really happy for you. Uh, bit of sugar. I need to get 10 of everything, of like sugar, flour, the cheese, I can make butter, flour, oats, rice, yeast. Just make sure I've got everything. Oh yeah, some sweet potatoes, so we can just buy those. I'm growing a few as well, just because I want, I want to see my farm growing. I like, I do like to see that. Right. Charm potion. Uh, no. Gloaming next. Let's go and boost up all of my plants and everything. 
check with Parker again, just make sure there's no new things to make. No. I'm desperate for new things to make. <laughs> I'm like, why won't anyone give me new things to make? There's like four things there that I haven't made. I want them now. <laughs> Alright then. I'll grow my blooming flowers. So you... can get boosted. We'll get 10 of them then, I think. Same with these. I think once I've got 10 of them, I should be alright for a little while. So I'm just going to let those grow for a couple more days and then we'll, we'll stop coming to the gloaming to plant things until I want more things. then next job let's see if shelby's around anywhere that is cabin or anything sometimes he has a walk on the beach as well although i think he sleeps in in the morning a lot though oh no he's here perfect i've finally got your night spells i'm so sorry it took so long i had to wait for spring thanks for helping out old shelby you're too kind I'll give you a fish stew as well. And we'll have a chat as well. Is that heavenly aroma? Fish stew? Why, thank you! What a beautiful day! Birds are singing. It's raining. Yeah, wish they wouldn't start so early. Can't sleep through all that racket. Nightmare. There we are. That's filled up his heart. Lovely. That's all we needed. Okay, I'm going to come across here like around about four o'clock and see if Lena comes down here. Although it's raining, so there might, that might not be a thing. Um, so let's pop to the mountain. No, let's... Yeah, yeah, pop to the mountain, then we'll bake the, the the cakes. And then we'll come down to Coven in the afternoon. Money. Hmm... One down here, maybe? Yep, one down here. More money. I'll head up the top and see if there's anything up there. I'm not seeing anything around the bottom here, so... Thinking it might be one of these. No, not up there either. Hmm. I'm sure I've probably missed something. Aha. And that was all money again today. Okay, that is fine. If I want to fish up here, and I, I kind of do, a, this is a spot I haven't fished out a ton. And so we might find a recipe here, you never know. But if I'm doing that, then I need to cut down the trees first because otherwise I can't see the bottles. And that's a bit annoying. Okay, so let's give it a go. Again with crickets because uh, I haven't got any chub yet. I might be able to pick some up actually today. I think 
Bruno might be open on a Monday. I still think I have one fish I haven't found in the mines as well. Like, let's see, on my fishing. I've got several river fish actually. A few ocean fish too. A couple of mountain fish and one mine fish. Yeah. Really need to fish in the river more. <laughs> Water days. Catch over this side. Yeah, I'll get so I'll get like a hundred chub just for me. Haha, uh -huh. I knew there'd be one. Oh, quick! No. I want the bottle and the bottle only. Yes. So at least we got one recipe in the mountains today. Is it? It is! A recipe! Praline cookies. So how are we looking now? Like, is this starting to look more full? Like the dessert section. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten recipes missing there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Eight there. We still got a lot to go. I should go and see our I should go and see the board over in Ravenwood Hollow actually. Um, I want to go and see Perry as well. I think I've had probably as much as I'm getting there from there today. Uh, so let's go and see Perry. Give her the charm potion. That way I'm getting through the things. And let's see if anybody here wants anything who is not already like my best bud. Yeah, Ariel wants feathers. There we are. Perfect. So that'll help. I thought you wanted a charm potion. Oh, did I not pick it up? Okay, fine. Let's just give Ariel the feathers then. And like maybe a milkshake. <laughs> Delightful. Thank you. And have a chat as well. Like I know I don't have the, I don't know how to make anything he likes, but that doesn't mean I can't just try and give him something. I hear Gloria has been returned home. All creatures deserve to be with family if they choose. Yay, we're nearly a quarter of the way there with him. <sighs> I so need some loved stuff. Even the quest just don't really cut it with him at all. Uh, why did Feedy not collect your eggs? Did your gem run out, Feedy? Hey, Feedy, get to it. I hope that when I change their gem over, it adds. Feedy, why are you not collecting the eggs? Don't make me do it. All right, now I've got other things to do. I need to make a cupcake and head over to Coven. Although today's probably not a great day for it because it's really rainy, but never mind. I'm gonna make a cupcake. Yeah, five chocolate cupcakes ready to go to Coven and have a party. I knew Juliet and Sebastian would be witches. I know that Finn and Emmy will eventually probably be them as well, which is why it's good that their dad knows all about it now. Let's have a rain party. Here are the cupcakes for the welcome party, High Priestess. Wonderful. Now, I've invited Sophia to join us as well so that she and Juliet feel comfortable. We'll have the party tomorrow night. Okay, well if it's raining tomorrow, I'll cast a sunshine spell. So that will be tomorrow night. Lovely. Okay, so uh, what else can we do today? Fly back and grab the... 
potion for Perry and uh, head into the mines and try and maybe see if I could get more recipes in there. We'll make some more crystal ball potions. Uh, find out more things that Gloria likes. We'll carry on working on the people we need to work on. Uh, match for the matchmaker. I can't wait for this. Ah. Uh, so Amira, Ariel, Bruno, Cameron, Gloria, Juliet, Kai, Lena, Sebastian, and Perry. That's what, 10 people that I'm still kind of actively working on and we're going to be slowly like chipping those off the list. Hey Wesley. I did a little boop. Aww. I love the four headrest. It's just utterly adorable. I've got wine for you. I'm going to go and cook you some roasts and things though. Um, but I'll need to get some meat from Kim oh, I think. I can't wait to drink some of this while reading the latest detective novels that came in. This is for you, sweetheart. I hope you like it. Why well, give me a present? Beef Wellington? Oh, thanks, dude. Oh. <laughs> that was so cute. Yeah, so I'm thinking I want to make some... Uh, where are all the roasts? Roast beef, roast pork, roast salmon. So roast salmon we don't have any salmon for, but we've got plenty of other stuff. Um, roast beef we don't have the carrots or the potatoes for, but I could get those from Lena if I wanted to. Roast pork, I can make a few. So, you'll be well fed, don't worry Wesley. And then I just want to head to the mines for like an hour or two at the end of the day and just see if I can get that final couple of recipes out of it. Um, I've had people say that you can catch fish in the gloaming. Uh, re no, you can catch fish, I know that. You can catch recipes in the gloaming. But as soon as I can get to Bruno, like I'll get like a hundred. A hundred chub and then we'll be, we'll be fishing with those and maybe we'll get more out of that than we have been with the crickets that I've been using so far. No luck so far. Not even much luck with catching new stuff either. There's something there with a red top to it. I want to see if I can catch that. just a salmon. It might just be a salmon. A blind eel. Okay. I think I already had a blind eel. There's definitely something down here that I still don't have. I've caught the blind cat, the blind eel, and several loach, several grotto sculpins. There's only five things down here, but this seems to be very uh, elusive. Maybe because I've not been fishing with Chub. Oh, and there it is. Recipe for me. I'll stay to get that at least. And then we'll go to bed and end the episode there, I think. I just got to wait for the splash. Don't be too impatient, Shilab. I found something. A recipe? Peking duck. Hey. Okay. <laughs> uh. Do seem to always get something at the bottom of the mine, so I don't know if it's if it's any 
more likely than anything else, but... Poor Ariel, still. <laughs> still nothing for him. Is it time for bed? It is. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Aww. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you all next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome. <laughs>